Hey guys, Buff Elgato here. I want to tell you some of the weapons that are coming in the new update for Warzone Season 3 and Cold War Season 3. It's going to hit on April 21st, 21. And what they are is, one is the SMG, the PPSH. We've seen this before in past games. It's a, a small submachine gun that was used throughout World War II, and it's got moderate damage, but really quick rate of fire. The way to unlock that is you're gonna to have to buy the Battle Pass when it hits, and you're gonna be, you're gonna to have to get the tier 15 to unlock that gun. The other one is gonna be a sniper rifle very similar to the Car 98 going to be called the Swiss K31. Now, if you remember in season two, we were introduced with the sniper rifle, the ZRG 20 millimeter. It was very slow, but very powerful, very heavy, very slow to reload. This is going to be pretty much the opposite. It is a bolt action sniper rifle, but it is going to be a lot like the car 98. It's going to have exceptional accuracy. It's going to be able to reload very quickly, very fast aiming speeds, and supposed to have a very large ammo capacity. I'm not sure how many bullets this is going to hold, but it's going to be supposedly significantly more than the Car 98. This may be the new meta for uh, sniper rifles. Uh, the way to unlock this one, you're going to have to be a level 31 in the Battle Pass to unlock that. That's tier 31. We're also going to be getting a ballistic knife. We've seen this before in some of the old um, Call of Duty games where it's just going to be basically a knife that you're going to hold in your hand and you're going to be able to shoot it at people. Hopefully it doesn't do as much damage as a throwing knife or this is going to be pretty much OP. It will be taking the place of a knife slot. So it's not going to be in a tactical uh, lethal uh, perk so far. Apparently from what I'm hearing from inside sources, it is going to take the place of a knife as your secondary. Um, anyway, that's about it on the weapons that we're going to be getting. So we're going to get all three of those day one as season three starts. As soon as we get the season um, update, we're going to have all access to all three of those weapons. I'm really, I'm really uh, excited to see what this Swiss uh, K31 is going to do. I think it, I think it might be meta. PPSH is going to be pretty dominant up close, and if you have that ballistic knife as a backup, it might be pretty deadly. We're going to be getting some new maps um, <laughs> for multiplayer, new operators, and something's going to be happening with the map as well. Now, I'm not going to go through all the different time zones for people across the world, but on April 21st, there are supposed to be different events happening throughout the day, plus server shutdowns. The creator of this game was a huge fan of what Fortnite did when they had the black hole open up for about three days. He said if he ever did anything, it would be just like that. So I'm actually looking for him to do something like that with maybe the nuke. Maybe we're staring at a nuclear explosion, the nuke uh, mushroom cloud for a few hours. I think it's going to be down um, part of the day, depending on where you're um, living at. It's going to be uh, down for a few hours. But we're probably going to be looking at something like that as earlier events are going to take place. And then probably the late afternoon of April 21st, we are going to be getting... Uh, there's rumors on a destroyed map, uh, an 80s map, or even a complete different map. So I'm excited. But guys, if you like this, please hit like, please share. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.